Hello and welcome back to another episode of Stu's Reviews. Today is another very quick episode sharing what I believe is the best top secret tip for the AmazeFit BIP. The BIP, I think, is the best fitness tracker available right now, slash smartwatch available right now. Well, that's because of its battery life, its capabilities, what it does and the way it looks. But if you're looking for a review of it, I'll leave a link in the description below. I've already done that. This is not a review. It's taking a look at the best kept secret of the Amazfit bit. Now, one of the biggest limitations of the bit, I thought, was the amount of watch faces. And you can only pick from maybe 12 different watch faces, which is a bit miserable and eventually you'll get bored of them. I discovered a way to install literally thousands of watch faces, and that is using both an Android and an iPhone. So, let's take a look at that. Now on the iPhone, it's very, very straightforward. All you have to do is download this application called Amaze Tools. Now if I pop in there, Oh, you can already see the custom face I've installed, but let's go back to the beginning here. This is what it looks like. It gives you an idea about your activity, but this is just another way of connecting with the Amazfit BIP. Now, that doesn't mean it replaces the MeFit app, which it works with. This is just an extra application. Now, what I can do here at the very, very bottom is browse. This is where I can search all of the available watch spaces. Now, at the moment, it's just showing me random ones we've got a resident evil inspired one here we've got a no quite a colorful simple style one there what else have we got god incredibly violent that is but they've got other ones such as nike uh, i think they've had pikachu ones in here but literally there are thousands now you can search by the most downloaded as well this shows you and um, potentially the most popular, such as this Mickey Mouse one. Now, all you do to install this face is tap it, tap download, and it downloads into your uh, downloads at the bottom. So by going into there, we can now see all the faces I've downloaded. For example, the Mickey Step Date Battery one. By tapping on it, I can tap install, and then what it does, if we put this next to the watch, all it does is update the resources, takes a few seconds, and there we go. It's on there, ready to go. So that is so simple, and I cannot believe that I've not realized I could do this before. And not only that, if you can't find the exact one that you would like in this app, there are a whole archive of watch faces available online. Just simply go to the website amazefitwatchfaces.com and you can select faces from all the different Amazfit watches there. But this is a massive community archive of loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of faces developed by people. And to install those, you just need to download the file, add it into your iCloud drive, and then what you do you go to more, install custom file, and then you can see here in my iCloud drive, I've added a bunch of different faces. So for example, I can tap something like Game Boy, and although it doesn't give me a preview, which is a bit annoying, I can tap install, and it still installs that watch face like this. Hold on. And there we go, I have a Game Boy face. I can't believe I missed this. This is possibly one of the best secrets that is no longer a secret. And it will help you get a load more out of your Amazfit BIP as well. Now, if you have an Android device, the process is pretty much very similar, but you download a different application called, what's it called? I can't believe you remember what it's called now. Hold on, I'll find out for you. It's called, where is it? Gadget Bridge. Download Gadget Bridge and it's a very similar process. The app is slightly different, but you simply just download the files into that 
and add them directly onto the watch. So if you are downloading watch faces, go to amazefitwatchfaces.com and that's where you can download the files for loads of different watch faces. But if you're using iPhone, the Amaze Tool app just gives you access to loads straight away. Guys, if you liked today's video, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. And if you really want to, you can also support me over on Patreon. And for about $1 a month, you'll get access to loads of cool stuff and discounts off products as well when I can offer them. And I'll see you back for another episode of Studio Reviews soon.